Good morning, this is Tony Chernowski, manager of the Practical Investor LLC. Today is June the 18th, 2009. I'm giving you today a little bit of technical market analysis, answering the question, is the top in? This video is meant for instruction and entertainment purposes only. This is not a solicitation to buy or sell any security. A purchase or sale of a security may result in a loss of principal. Please consult with an expert advisor who may explain the risks of any investment you may consider. You cannot invest directly in an index. Good morning, this is Tony Chernowski again, and I'd like to just visit with you briefly about a couple of major events that have happened in the last week or so. And what I'd like to do is start off with the Standard & Poor's Index and give you an idea of what's happening. Remember, I've been warning for about a, the last month that we're in a topping process and here goes let's take a look at what's going on well the standard and poor's index has a, may have officially topped on june the 11th 2009 i have a red arrow to the right of the chart showing you what's uh, potentially has happened and to uh, to show the technical side of things i've got a trend line which has been broken uh, as of uh, this week and now the Standard & Poor's Index is resting on the 200-day moving average. Now one of the things you could say about the 200-day moving average is that you could call this somewhat of a modified or complex head and shoulders pattern because should the S&P break through uh, below 904 on the Standard & Poor's Index, we could have a, a neckline breakthrough which gives the Standard & Poor's Index quite a little distance to go into the mid 800s or so uh, as a target on a head and shoulders pattern. So I uh, just want you to be aware of what's potentially happening here and to, as a follow-up what I would like to also look at is uh, another uh, index, the BKX, the banking index, which has also broken its uptrend line. Uh, it also has a complex head and shoulders pattern as well as an, uh, uh, an expanding wedge formation. All of these uh, prove to be bearish. In this case, the pattern uh, target is the bottom of the wedge formation on the BKX, which is 26. That's quite a little distance to drop. So just be forewarned that things are going to get a little exciting in the market. I just wanted to also let you know that uh, to keep up to date on a day-to-day -day basis, our subscribers can now, new subscribers can now uh, receive a four-month subscription for the price of three. Uh, these uh, subscriptions that renew on a quarterly basis, and since this is mid-June, uh, the subscription will run through mid-October. So uh, just want to uh, inform all of you viewers that uh, and potential uh, subscribers that uh, there's a little bit of a benefit here of signing up uh, financially as well as getting a day-by-day blow-by-blow uh, recap of what's going on in the market as it happens. So this is real-time analysis that will be given to you every day uh, that the market is open. I hope you all have a great spring and uh, what's left of it uh, and uh, a very prosperous summer and by all means please do the right thing we'll be in touch later thank you